and I got a kill with cup. That's cabbage. Cabbage. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Good day sa inyo dyan. So today, we're gonna be making sourdough sandwich bread. And this is actually my sixth pang-anim na na, pang -anim na na sandwich bread that I made this week. And so, I have a dough here that has been rising, has been proofing for 12 hours now. And we're gonna shape it and put it in the bread pan. And then, lalagay natin siya sa oven. We can give it to daddy and he's gonna eat the sandwich. Sabi na he wants cold. I've been practicing making bread this week. Kasi that's one of my goals for 2022. To be able to make bread for my family. Para hindi na kami bibili sa store. But, you know, we're still traveling. So, that's something na hindi na may iwasan. We still... Pag hindi kami nakagawa ng food for our trip, we still need to, to eat out. But this is one of my goals for 2022 to learn how to bake some bread. But um, these past years, I've been making like rolls, sweet breads, but not, you know, actual loaf bread or bread for sandwiches. So chocolate bread, ube bear bread and sardo bread kinds of different things. Oh, cool. And maybe squash. Squash bread. And syrup. Mmm, sarapina. Yes. So this bread that I've been learning how to make it's made with sourdough. So sourdough starter. It's good for your gut health because it's it's wild yeast and it's really easy to make. I'm gonna link on the des description below kung paano gumawa ng sourdough starter. The reasons why I bake with sourdough is be it's because um, it's high in fiber. High in fiber and it's rich in nutrients and protein. And it's also easier to digest ng ating katawan. So that's the reason why I've been using sourdough. And also, um, it's also only ano lang, flour. Flour, salt, water, and sugar, and that's all the ingredients that I use. So, ito yung dough that has been rising for 12 hours now, and medyo pindot pindot niya ngayon, that's why ganyo itsura niya, but it has doubled in size, so it's ready to be baked. Pero ang gagawin natin is gonna, we're gonna shape it, we're gonna let, we're gonna do a second rice for an hour, and then it's ready to be put in the oven.
So ngayon, after 2 hours ng ating second rice, ready na ang ating dough for baking. So ayan, nag, nag uh, rice na siya ng about an inch. So lagay na natin siya sa oven. So, andito na si Tai. He just got back from work and he's gonna take out the, the bread because it's ready now. I'm here too. Look and out, I'm, bub. Oh, wait long, baby. And I got a kill with cup. That's cabbage. Cabbage. Wow. Wow. Look at that one. Daddy, <laughs> daddy, a, daddy, 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 A bread knife would cut up nice slices. I don't have one, so we'll just use what we got here. So, nasa rental house pa rin kami. Ta is finishing the job here sa North Carolina para makauwi na kami soon. This bread for breakfast is done! It was in the toaster for five minutes. Mommy loves five minutes. I know he loves it. I know she loves that toaster. It's really good. You hear that? Beep, beep, beep. Maybe it was the oven. Okay, let's pray for Jesus. Dear Jesus, we thank you for this birthday case and for our gas food for the Jesus name. In. Okay, we're gonna try it if it's good or sweet. Okay? Sourdough. Hmm? I'm the sourdough. Mm. Tara. Like this. Mm. <laughs> mm. so That's hard. <laughs> mm. How up? Very good. Mm. 